This is Lawnmower Nation. Today, we're going to be showing you the internal parts of a small engine. Okay? So here we go. A lot of people take lawnmowers for granted. I figure you guys should know the inner workings of the, of the small engine. This here is called your cylinder head. Okay? This is your block. Okay? The block is made up of two parts. There is the crankcase and then the cylinder. You also have your valves right there. Those are valve springs right in here and your exhaust port. Basic knowledge. This is your crankcase cover. This goes over top of the crankcase right here just like this. Here is another basic component. This is your flywheel. This helps carry out the inertia through the engine, crank it over. It helps create spark. And it also helps cool the engine because when these fins spin, it blows wind into the shroud, creating a cooling mechanism. This is your muffler right here. This is your your crankshaft see it's counterbalanced with these weights and your crankshaft connects to your piston your piston is has a your piston has a connecting rod which is this the piston crown the piston skirt the piston, the wrist pin, which makes it turn, and the connecting rod cap, which connects it to the crank shaft, like so. Just like that. And then when it turns, it makes compression in the engine, which powers stuff. Okay, here. Is the, is the cylinder head. The cylinder head goes over here like that and your cylinder bolts here, your head bolts, go right in those holes. And then that creates a nice seal. When you get your gasket, you put your gasket in there and that'll create a nice seal. Okay, here. This is your camshaft. Nowadays they're made of plastic. They used to be made of metal. They're kind of kind of weak. But here's your these here are your weights. Counterbalance it. And that would go right in here. Which would then connect to your crankshaft. Like this. And that would go in there. And every time you're spinning, it turns the crank, the cam. The cam, the cam is important. See what the cam does? It spins this oil slinger. This oil slinger here slings oil into all the inner working mechanisms of the engine and gets it everywhere, which is very good for nice, smooth, workings here is your valve cover right there and these are your valve tappets these valve tappets go inside your valve inside your engine just like this which they run off the crankshaft see right in here the valve tappets go in these holes, which then connect to the valves, and every time the camshaft turns, it turns your valve, just like that. See that? Your tap goes in there, pushes on your, your valve, turns the valve, lets it compression, exhaust, compression, exhaust, intake, exhaust, compression, you know. Okay, 
we got power, intake, compression, exhaust. Intake, compression, power, exhaust. There you go. Here is your shield for your flywheel. This is a spark plug. This is what creates spark. This connects to the cylinder head and goes in there and you spin it. And every time the magneto, which I don't have, the magneto hits these magnets. It goes in here. Every time this flywheel spins, magneto hits the magnet, and which keeps opening up and closing the magnetic field of the magneto, which then delivers to the spark plug, creates spark in your engine, and there you go. I also don't have here is the e carburetor. The carburetor has a venturi system. It goes on and it and it freaking it just freaking puts that gas in there and you know it's real nice and you hear right here these are your piston rings these go in here so it stops the oil from they go right on here it stops the oil from getting into your crank into your um, combustion chamber this is the combustion chamber right here and there you go basic components um this is your oil cap for your drain plug drain plug here Crankshaft, camshaft, crankcase, cylinder, valves, exhaust port, crankcase cover, piston, muffler, cylinder head, your flywheel and then all your nice bolts that hold this puppy together there you go this is lawnmower nation see you later